Hello everyone, uh, welcome to the stream. We're going to be doing some uh, Guess the Celebrity games today using our um, Axie Draw drawing robot. So, kind of get an idea of how the robot operates, but also a little fun game while you're on your lunch break here to um, try to guess the celebrity that our machine is drawing. So, if you have questions, drop them in the chat. If you have a guess, go ahead and throw it out there as well. We'll see um, a little bit of the software first before we jump into the hardware. So let's work on that. Is it for the... Let's see. Here we go. All right, so we can see a little bit of the software here. We're using um, is Squiggle Cam, which will take your images and turn them into squiggle line art. And that's what we're going to be um, working with today. So a little bit of uh, about that. You have your your image, all right. Um, we're gonna upload an image, uh, downloading Mr. Tom Cruise. We're going to use that image, and then you can see here on the right-hand side, it makes little squiggle lines of art to increase the frequency, the wavelength of each of those to make um, some areas darker or some areas lighter, depending on the background and things like that. So what we're going to do um, is do a few of these today. Obviously, we're not going to do uh, Mr. Cruz here, but you can also adjust these to get the image to come out more abstract. Whenever you start to lose who that might be, or you can make it a little more apparent there. So really cool software. You can actually do this for um, this same program for a laser cutter. You can actually even 3D print this. Um, SVG, you can upload it. Um, any of your, your friends or anything like that as well would be kind of a cool process um, to do there. So. We're going to jump. You're going to guess it was Tom Cruise. That, was, that would have been a pretty pretty easy one. Um, let's see here. Alright, our first one here. We're going to go ahead. First one, we're gonna go ahead and get started using the Axie Draw. If you joined me last time I did a stream here, it was also on the Axie Draw, so you got a little bit of an overview, but if not, it is our pen drawing robot. It uses pens, markers, sharpies, whatever you want, pencils. Um, and you can produce artwork, you can produce line art, you can produce blueprints, or anything like that. Um, you can even throw, um, you know, fountain pen in there and do letters and artwork that way. So we're going to be doing this little generative design art today um, to see how we do guessing the the celebrity. We need a little bit of setup of the machine just to make sure it's going to work for us. Have a little bit of technical difficulty. We're trying to get the camera to actually show what's happening. One second.
me turned around But I can't ignore The feelings that I found In this whole damn thing That we got going You hold the strings Without me knowing Why do I Have to suffer through the thinking Why do I Have the feeling that I'm sinking I need to find a way Okay, there we are. We're back um, working this time, so you'll be able to see as it makes the the lines, those squiggle lines, it is a continuous line for all the way across, and we're going to um, sit here, watch these first one with you, answer any questions you may have, and then I'm going to turn my face cam off. First guest we have in is Carrot Top. Not a bad guess for what we can see so far. It is pretty mesmerizing to watch the, the machine run. I was a little surprised the first time I ran this that it didn't just go back the other way. Um, with Bill Murray as a guest. Um, if I played around with it a little bit more in the code, I could probably figure out a way to make it just go back and forth and speed this process up. But I'm not in a, a huge rush uh, today here hanging out with y'all. in the chat earlier the um, the website that you we I did all these from big shout out to the owner of that website who um, made this open source and allowed this for other people to use it's super helpful um, doing that hey, hosting that there on github uh, if you guess it correctly um, and at the end Whenever it's supposed to be done, I will give it a, a, you, know, you a shout out. Then you were the first one to guess it correctly. Uh, Tom Hanks guess. Pretty strong about Bill Murray. Some of the ones we're going to be doing today are going to be pretty easy. You'll notice them very early on. Um, other ones, I think you're going to, you know, it's going to be some stumpers. I do have some clues. Um, written down as well if, if we start getting near the end and there's a there's no correct guesses but I am here in the uh, the hill maker space today we are reopen um, students faculty staff at NC 
NC State to come on in and use our services and uh, use awesome machines like this one. Carrot Top. We have an Oprah, I guess. A lot of good guesses so far. In the past, we've done uh, you know, postcards with Actually Draw. We've done um, birthday cards. We've done drawn uh, promotional giveaways with them. Um, really geometric designs and um, just kind of starting now with um, using this, the squiggle and um, the, the polka dot feature which is another thing you can do is a lot of small dots rather than squiggle lines to do um, artwork so really cool kind of eye-opening experience the eyes will give it away most of the time yeah um, you know, that was Clark Kent's secret. He disguised around his eyes and it worked fine. So, uh, most people, yeah. Weird Al. That's a, oh, that's another good guess. This is the point here where it's like, it could be, it could be a lot of these, these guesses here. Weird Al cosplaying his carrot top. That would be that would be a good trick there, but I'd... done any costumes. And you kind of see the pin in a little bit, a little bit more focused there now. Hopefully the bar doesn't get too far in the way as it draws. And you see that servo that lifts it up each time as it goes back. Picking Oprah too. Picking Oprah is correct. So a lot of people are getting are uh, thinking that Oprah guess from earlier was the correct one. Are there any other guesses out there? Or do, do we think that one spring is over? Is that right? Indeed, the first one here is Oprah. NCSU mom did guess it back there first, so um, congratulations. I think everyone knew that one. As I said, we're starting off fairly easy, and then we're going to get a little, a little more difficult as we go along. So. Congratulations again, NCSU mom, for guessing, guessing Oprah. Pretty popular figure right now. Oh, it looks like my dot cam froze. Give me one second.
Yeah, we'll be right back. Just adding our camera back in. Had a little little freeze. Alright, we have it back up and running for for, for now. We'll see. Uh, hopefully it keeps going. As you see here, it, Oprah is finishing up. Um, congrats again. Um, so you guys that correctly. I think we all figured it out there near the end. Now we are going to, as this finishes here, it's got a few more lines. We will... Uh, hang out, watch it run a little bit longer, and then I will uh, get the second person set up and ready to run. i 
I'm rich, I'm rich. Starting here on celebrity number two for the day. First few lines. This first one does a the dots all the way across, and then it'll start to squiggle here and just shortly. So hang out, listen to the music, keep an eye, see if you can figure out who the celebrity might just be. Like we've come to the end of the road There's no point in running away now I'd rather sleep until the storm is gone She'd rather be shooting at me now I know we will end up in anger I don't think we grew up, we just became older She's aiming her words, ready to fire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire So we've got some early guesses in here. Elijah Wood. Charlie Brown. Frankenstein. All good guesses so far for what we can see.
had an Ash Ketchum guest come in. I will let you in, you all in on a, a little hint. These are all real life uh, celebrities that we'll be doing with today. Um, maybe next stream that I do, we'll do some some characters from TV shows, movies. So, n not Frodo. Um, I don't think I chose any celebrities where I'm using their their characters they may have portrayed or played over the years. I'm pretty sure these are all just normal celebrity photos. But there's always next time. Measurably disappointed. Maybe if we get through all of the ones we have done today, we can uh, throw a Frodo there for Librarian Colin. Uh, Technobondus the Rock. It's a good guess with the, 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 the forehead that we can see right now on this person. We'll have to wait and see. Let's let's let it let it run. Sorry about that. We were working on getting a new uh, a new dock cam here. It did run. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to. Can't pause it, but um, hopefully this, this we can get this solved for us. Christopher Walken guest came in. These are a little tougher as we go along. Shirt Schubert. Guess is Tom Hanks. I'm sorry if I mispronounced that there.
we're a little over halfway here on this drawing. Each one of these drawings is um, set up to be 13 centimeters in each dimension. So a nice square photo. Once we're done, we can uh, we'll, we'll look at the Oprah drawing from the first one. We'll look at the Tom Hanks one once this one finishes here. Still don't know this one, Sponsor. Yeah, I accidentally let that slip. That slip there. Um, it will be once you get to the, the the nose and the mouth. On most of these, gets pretty obvious. Um, sorry, librarian Colin. These do these do get tougher. We will uh, see you in the next few as well. We have three more at least lined up, and then uh, potentially we can do some some custom ones for people. Uh, but we'll see. Or we may wrap it after those next three, and then we can uh, we'll save some for next time. That is correct, Gav. Yeah, the, the focus on, on the dot cam, as that pin comes closer, it wants to focus on that. So whenever we get that brief second, um, when it focuses in on the drawing itself, it does it is a lot more clear. And uh, like I said, once uh, once these are done, I'll hold them up here on, on my, my face cam so that you'll be able to uh, I see the drawings and we'll talk we'll talk a little bit about the machine before we start this next one It did indeed freeze again. Again, apologies for. Uh, I currently have my uh, Makerspace student assistant who's in here with me um, running and grabbing me a new document camera. So 
Um, apologies for that. And we are nearing the end of our second Guess the Celebrity drawing. Uh, we were using a, 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 a PIVO uh, VZR document camera. Um, for the for the wide range of stuff we, we're doing on our stream here, whether it's sewing or um, crafting to, to grind into a machine like this, the IPVO. Yeah. Um, it, it usually works very well. Today we're getting some some issues out of it. Maybe for these next ones too, I'll, I'll try a slightly different angle to see if that helps with, with the focus as well. just tried locking the focus on this camera hopefully that will make it a little easier might make it when the pins over it a little more blurry but we'll see there we are that one is finished shout out schubert sherbert 7274 uh for getting tom hanks um before i spoiled it for the rest of y'all so i'm gonna grab this one off real quick we'll switch so you can kind of see the, the squiggles up close Over here. 
All right, so here is the Tom Hanks drawing. As you can see from a distance, it definitely comes together a little more clearly. Um, if we look at the, the up close, see if my webcam can focus in here. You'll see each of the individual squiggle lines that it produces. It's not wanting to autofocus very well um, with this, this webcam. But, and then we will show you. First one from Guess the Celebrity, Oprah Winfrey. So, a little bit more uh, with this one. This is the. the Tom Hanks was the first one that I made this morning, in all transparency. And then Oprah here, I figured out adding more lines made it look um, way more clear, way more obvious um, of who it was. So you can kind of see in that software, on that website, I guess, um, the difference of taking a few minutes, moving some stuff around. Let me move these a little closer where you can see them. You can kind of see the clarity difference there. And this is only about 70 lines. Um, you can actually go up to, I believe, right at 200 lines for one of these thir uh, 13 centimeters. So, so quite a bit. Um, we are really quickly adding in a new dot cam. So bear with us for just a second. We'll be right back um, with hopefully a slightly uh, more stable camera for us. library calling call it. that is in fact what we are doing here uh, camera is set up we're gonna try to go ahead and switch over to our next celebrity And here we go, We're trying a slightly different angle. We might play around with it for this first one. We'll see. So 
blurry. Alright, so we're still having some focusing issues, but we're, we're rolling with it, trying to figure out um, how we can solve that. Uh, Audrey Hepburn just came in as a guest. There's Peter Ginsburg coming in as a guest. to 
All right, I think we have our other document camera back up and running. Um, resolution's a little bit better on it. We'll, we'll, we'll try this one out still. Um, next time we do this, we'll, we'll uh, do a little bit more more testing beforehand with these these machines. Um, you know, most of our uh, streams here are very either computer-based or uh, very briefly document camera based this one's uh, more heavy on the document camera and needs to work this is gonna go smoothly so uh, we do apologize for all the uh, technical difficulties we've had today but still enjoy our time here with y'all hopefully you have the same we do have the eyes coming up
we have any other guesses out there who this might be our last guesses were uh, Audrey Hepburn and Ruth Bader Ginsburg JD Bradway, we did we did finish Tom Hanks, so there was oh, there was the, that Tom Hanks. Um. <laughs> you you missed uh, uh, some some technical difficulties, and then as well as the start of this this third celebrity here. Yeah, I feel I feel that as well, Librarian Con. Um, it, I'm I'm honestly shocked that this one has not been has not been gotten yet. I almost did did this one first, as I thought it might be the the easiest of the five to to guess. Colin is wanting Frodo very badly to appear in this stream. guesses here on our third person we have a, uh, a, a a patron coming into this the space we'll see we'll give them a chance to guess the drawing uh, since no one here on twitch has guessed it yet
All right, they were also stomped as well as my, my student worker. That is the one, the only Beyonce there for our third guest, the celebrity. We're gonna take a moment. We'll be right back. Um,
All right, and we're back with our fourth guest, that celebrity. Go ahead and got started here. Um, Seventeen-year-old no Beyonce pretty. I'm not surprised that that's you know this one. Um, a little more celebrity that's not been. Um, you know, in the news all that much the last few years, but um, is a celebrity nonetheless. We'll let it run for, for just a little bit. Hopefully not having any technical difficulties, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. So we'll roll with it. Um, and here we go. Ah, I really should have done one of these upside down just to, just to throw you off there. That would have been some classic hijinks to, to start from the bottom. Thank you. 
All right, we've had some guesses come in. Uh, Elizabeth Dole, Fred Savage, is it Fonzie? Oh no, if I've done Henry Winkler and use an old old picture um, of Fonzie, that would have been that would have been another good one. That would, but keep those guesses coming. We're not quite there yet. A few more guesses, Eric Estrada, Library underscore Colin. Um, not quite either of those. Um, showing this off today to a few coworkers here in the building. They've already uh, requested me to do this at a department meeting to, to, to guess the coworker. So in the future, Library underscore Colin might have might be doodled here by the the axi draw, but not today. Colin says he turns out I'm bad at recognizing celebrities, uh, especially when it, you know it's a little bit different. It's not your your common photo. Who is this? And when you're you know facial features all together makes sense. You start separating them out. It's a little bit harder. Not being able to see the, f the full face. Yeah. That's why you throw throw a, a you know as a superhero throw a mask on or anything like that. It, it works apparently. I've been misrecognized numerous times in the last year. So, facial features hard to pick out sometimes. Getting down to the near the mouth section of, of of this celebrity. Let's keep those guesses coming in.
Well, there it is. It looks like you, Library Con, figured it out. It is Zach Galifianakis. Alumni here from NC State. Follow uh, Hangover Movie co-star King John went just down the road to at Duke University. So nice little triangle connection for for, the, for those two often working together. But Library Con does he did find the source photo there as well. So I right. good job. Uh, Colin, yeah, it did take take a bit once the beard started coming in. I think it really um, really made sense there. We had some other guests, uh, Broadway guests, maybe himself, um, and we had some guesses from here in the makerspace of uh, Adam Driver. So all all good guesses there on that one we do have one more so stick around as this one wraps up we'll get it switched over and do our last one which i believe may be the toughest one of the day Stopping us, fly without boarding pass. Couldn't catch me, I'd be moving fast. Call me a shooting star.
Shooting star, got more than a couple of people going mad. I swear they're rooting hard. Tell them I'd be big in a game like she went and got them breast implants. I said I'm moving too fast, didn't even get a glance. I'm ready to eat up track like I'm seated in a restaurant. Yeah. If you had swag like mine, you know it's best to plant. Yeah. We are hating because you want shining like it's the yarn, drop like kings of the yarn. Shooting stars across the galaxy, and there it is. Exactly awesome, man. Okay. Completed. Last one. We're getting it loaded up now. And we're off on the fifth and final guest the celebrity of the day. Let's all sit back, watch these first few lines, and uh, start throwing some guesses out there once we get a little bit closer.
<laughs> Tons of uh, funny answers getting thr thrown out already. Will Shat William Shatner, William Shakespeare, William Foe, Mo Williams, Will Farrell, Will Wheaton. But will they get the correct one? I'm sorry, I had to say it. Terrible puns coming in. I'm getting waved out the door by here. The the folks here in the maker space shaking heads and pointing for me to leave, so I was just uh, mute my mute my mic, sit back, listen to the music with you all as we watch this one run for a little bit longer. Uh, no, the the music is not supposed to be a clue. I just cho chose something to get a nice tempo and sound and can just uh, hopefully help mesmerize the, the senses as you're watching it.
We have a few more guesses coming in. Barbara Eden, Elizabeth Olsen. Just begun. We will always take a stand for the people, for the land. Let's go back to when we were young. For the animals we stand. Let's go back to when trees were swung. Savannah, I'm coming home, Savannah, we'll never be alone, Savannah, the beauty of the world, Savannah, let's all take a walk, Savannah.
All right, just a few more lines and a few more minutes left here in the stream. We've had a few guesses come in. Um, Mary Kate, not but not Ashley Olson. Um, Susan Sarandon, my neighbor, um, or Lori Laughlin from Full House. So. This is the one, the only Scarlet Witch herself, Elizabeth Olsen. So good job, Library of Colin. You you had it, but it kind of went away from it. And uh, but we'll still give credit to you. You did guess it correctly. So. It is indeed Elizabeth Olsen. We had um, five of them throughout throughout the uh, the time today. Let's switch over. So, Library Collins getting Elizabeth Olsen as well as. Zach Galifianakis, so congratulations there. We had Bradway's daughter, the only person that got Beyonce. Um, Schubert7274 um, had got Tom Pink. And then lastly, NCSU mom getting Oprah Winfrey. So thanks everyone. I enjoyed my time. Thanks for bearing with us, our technical difficulties. Uh, thank you for Colin for helping me out moderating the board and stuff like that. Thank you to my, my student worker here who's helped me and ran cables and things like that for me while I was streaming just so I wouldn't have to, to stop and come back to all of y'all. So thank you so much. Uh, we do have a, a stream coming up later tonight, um, so come back, check us out, and we will, uh, I'll see you next time.